Hello, I am Drag, and welcome back, welcome back to me. Before I start the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Follow me on all my other social medias, uh, give me money on Ko-fi, I'm active on Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, all that'll be in the link below. So, straight on to it, I have a new setup. That, that is the video that you're going to be watching while I talk about this, um, and, uh, my commission weeks. Yes, yes, that is going to be the the video that you are watching today. Yes. So, put simply, I recently finished a commission week. Fantastic, right? I love doing commission weeks. Uh, for those who don't know, commission weeks is like a once a month thing where I just, like the whole week, I'm streaming nothing but commissions. It's a great time. Everything is discounted. There's free booze. It's awesome. I love it. I love doing them. But I had to stop doing them. So jumping back, the reason why I started to do commission weeks was because I needed to remain productive as far as art goes while maintaining my theater schedule. Basically, I always have a difficult time doing art while also having a big thing planned. It's like an ADHD thing, apparently. So if you have something like really big to do that day, you basically can't do anything else. Because if you do anything else, then you won't be able to do that thing because either you'll forget about it or the thing that you start doing to occupy your time ends up taking too long. I thought, what if I just did a whole week of commissions? It'll be, it'll be great. It'll give me a set schedule from 11 to 3. Think of the money. And then that still gives me enough time to get dressed and then drive to her. Think of the money. Right? So that's what I did. And it was great. They, they were a lot of fun. I ended up getting more commissions because people liked watching their commissions be done. And I really liked it too because money. If the, if the client didn't like something, I could just look over at chat and they could say, oh, here, could, oh, could you like change this thing right here? I'm like, oh my God, this is so much easier than having to like send it via email or send it through you know, whatever, um, whatever, we, whatever we were communicating through. And that also means that it cut down so much of the wait time is what takes commissions so long. So that is what I did. It was great. I loved it. Unfortunately, my computer wasn't able to maintain the process of streaming, compressing the videos, uploading those videos, streaming while having two incredibly bulky programs open and the internet all at the same time. And it just like kind of got too much. And basically the stream would crash like three times, three times a stream. It was like really killed the vibe of the stream. So I ended up just recording uh, my process and that, I mean, I, I still got commissions done, but it wasn't the event that I wanted it to be, you know? So I had to like sort of find a way to get that back and I couldn't. So I had to just stop streaming and then my whole like... <sighs> Basically, this space that I used to draw, I couldn't use anymore. So I had to like, basically, I'm in my room right now. And I didn't want to set up my computer and tablet in my room because there's nowhere to draw in my room. So I had to use my iPad. I had already had Procreate, but I didn't really like using Procreate because Procreate is like drawing in a sketchbook, but it's like not a sketchbook. It's a hunk of metal and plastic. So I'm like, okay, okay. But it automatically records everything. So I'm like, okay, okay, okay. I can uh, transfer over the rest of the commissions that I was going to do there. And uh, it'll be great. It'll be great. Except it doesn't record it. The, pro the, the way Procreate records speed paints versus how OBS re records speed paints are two completely different experiences. The reason why you can video record on Procreate is so that you can kind of see where you made a mistake. You see the the image as a whole versus on things like OBS, when you're recording it, you're recording the screen. You're recording each individual action, right? You're recording in the zoomies, the, uh, the reference that you pulled up. And people love to see the little zoomies. I know I love to see those little zoomies. So when I'm, I'm like recording these videos, I'm like, this video was god awful. And I was running low on videos to, like, actually compress and record because, you know, the I spent fucking 17 hours on a, on a commission once. 
and it only recorded, let's say, five minutes. It was like, that... Do, do you have any idea how demoralizing that is? That is so demoralizing. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I had to find a way to, like, get it, get those zoomies back. So, I got in contact with a friend who also streams, and he also uses Procreate. I'm like, how do you record on Procreate? Please tell me. And he's like, oh, oh, it's this program. It's great. You just download it on your computer. It turns your computer into like an Apple TV. And then you just record it from there. And they're like, oh my God, send me that program. After about a month, he finally sent it. And after about a week, I downloaded it. Then I just like started, you know, just like using it. And so that, and then, and then that brought back the commission weeks. I love doing commission weeks. I love them. I love them so much. Because you get to see what I'm doing, and I get at least five videos <laughs> that I can make from warm-up sketches alone. Oh my god. But I need to talk about the background that I'm making right now. The background is something that I wanted, because the way that it looks, like, I still wanted it to look the same, but I didn't, I, I knew that I had to change it up. So what I wanted was I wanted, like, a sort of, like, dine-in like a sort of dinner sort of like aesthetic but I also want to use the cafe mix art style right because I love that little chibi me so I had to like figure out how I was going to make that work and so basically I wanted a sort of like very a, a very minimalistic background where I could have my art links at the top I could have my little uh my little persona at the bottom and then I had no idea what I was going to put in the middle I just knew that I needed that space to like be something you know and so i'm just like oh crap what do i put in it what do i put in it i'm just like why don't you just make it the windows have it be like in your duraludon building building dinner theater whatever the fuck i'm like all right all right that's fine that's fine that's fine but i still had no idea what i was gonna do so i pondered on this while i was streaming i was actively streaming while i was doing this and it ultimately culminated in what you guys are looking at now. I was like, oh, what if it's like a little showcase of like my my commissions, my art, like my, my art in general. Because I know that a lot of artists, when they're streaming, will have just like um, a little like slideshow going on. And so once I figured that out, I'm like, okay, well, let's get to work. Let's get to work, babes. And then um, that, that, uh, that is where we are now. That is a, uh, that is where we are now. I really like this. I am very excited to be doing more commission weeks. Uh, my next one is actually going to be, ooh, this month. Okay. Um, as of as next month, as of recording this, but hopefully when the video goes up, it is this month. I'm thinking that I'm going to have them like once a month again. I already get, uh, finished a really big commission week. So yeah, I guess I'm going to call a video here. I stream on Twitch. I post on Instagram and Twitter. I'm sorry. X. And uh, give me money on Kofi because Lord knows I need it, like I said. Um, but yeah, until next time. Bye.